Imagine a 50-ton beast, capable of reaching speeds of 70 km per hour, armed with a 120mm smoothbore gun that can penetrate the toughest armor. This isn't the stuff of science fiction but a very real, very formidable machine. Welcome to the world of the Type 90 tank, Japan's main battle tank, and a symbol of its technological prowess and military might. Designed and built by Mitsubishi Heavy Industries, the Type 90 was brought to life to replace the aging Type 61 and to supplement the fleet of Type 74 tanks. It's a 50-ton testament to Japan's commitment to defense, capable of delivering devastating firepower with pinpoint accuracy. Its speed, agility, and firepower make it one of the most formidable tanks in the world. The Type 90 tank, a symbol of Japan's technological prowess and military might. This is the beast from the east, and it's ready for whatever the world throws its way. The birth of the Type 90 tank was not an overnight event it was a product of years of research and development. The Type 90, an impressive beast of modern warfare, was conceptualized in the late 70s as Japan's answer to the rapidly evolving field of armored warfare. The Japan Ground Self-Defense Force or JGSDF had a daunting task at hand. They had to design and build a tank that could replace the aging Type 61 and stand shoulder to shoulder with the Type 74 tanks. This was no small feat given the technological advancements in tank warfare at the time. The initial blueprints were drawn up by the Defense Agency's Technical Research and Development Institute, with Mitsubishi Heavy Industries roped in for the manufacturing. The first prototype was completed in 1982, and from there began a lengthy process of testing and refinement. The development of the Type 90 was fraught with challenges. One of the most significant was creating a tank that was compact enough for Japan's narrow roads and hilly terrain, yet powerful enough to hold its own on the battlefield. The engineers at Mitsubishi and the JGSDF had to think outside the box, incorporating cutting-edge technologies and innovating on existing ones. The Type 90 was one of the first tanks to use modular ceramic composite armor, providing superior protection while keeping the weight down. The tank was also equipped with a state-of-the-art fire control system and a 120 mm smoothbore gun, giving it formidable firepower. But perhaps the most significant challenge was the economic aspect. The initial cost estimates were staggering with each tank costing nearly $9 million. The Japanese government had to balance its budget constraints against the need for a modern, capable battle tank. The solution? A phased production plan with the first units entering service in 1990. Through years of painstaking effort, trial and error, and a relentless pursuit of excellence, the Type 90 tank came to life. A symbol of Japan's technological prowess, and a testament to its commitment to defense. The Type 90 tank, a testament to Japan's relentless pursuit of technological advancement and military superiority. The Type 90 tank is not just a showpiece, it is a battle-hardened war machine. Let's delve into the annals of military history to explore the various deployments of this magnificent machine. The Type 90, with its imposing stature and advanced capabilities has been at the forefront of numerous military exercises demonstrating its prowess in diverse terrains and under challenging conditions. Imagine the austere landscapes of Hokkaido, a northern island of Japan known for its harsh winters and rugged terrains. It was here that the Type 90 first flexed its muscles during the annual Northern Army Winter Training Session. The tank's superior mobility and firepower were put to the test, and it emerged triumphant, navigating the icy terrain with ease and precision and assuring its place in Japan's military arsenal. Not only has the Type 90 been a stalwart in local exercises, but its metal has also been tested on international stages. During the multinational military exercise known as Orient Shield, the Type 90 showcased its capabilities alongside military hardware from across the world. The tank's sophisticated armor and cutting-edge weaponry held its own against the world's top military equipment. But the true testament to the Type 90's capabilities came during the disaster relief operations following the devastating Great East Japan earthquake in 2011. Deployed for logistics and recovery operations, the Type 90 proved its worth beyond the battlefield. Its agility and robustness were instrumental in navigating the disaster-stricken areas, aiding in the recovery and rebuilding efforts. The Type 90 tank is not merely a machine of war but a symbol of resilience and adaptability. Its versatility and strength have seen it rise to every challenge, from the battlefield's dust and debris, to the rubble of a disaster-stricken homeland. In every deployment, the Type 90 has proved itself a reliable and formidable force, a testament to Japan's engineering prowess and tactical acumen. The Type 90 tank is more than a piece of technology, 
It is a symbol of national pride, a beacon of strength, and a testament to the resilience of the Japanese spirit. It stands as a reminder of Japan's commitment to peace, safety, and security. The Type 90 tank, a symbol of Japan's military might and a testament to its tactical brilliance. The Type 90 tank has left an indelible mark in the annals of military history. Serving as a testament to Japanese technological prowess, this mechanical beast has not only redefined the battlefield, but also influenced the design and development of armored vehicles, worldwide. The Type 90 tank with its advanced features and capabilities has been a game-changer in modern warfare. Its superior firepower, agility and defensive systems have set new standards for what a main battle tank should be. This has compelled other countries to rethink their approach to tank design, sparking a wave of innovation and advancement in the field of armored warfare. Its influence is not limited to the battlefield alone. The Type 90 has also had a significant impact on the military-industrial complex. Mitsubishi Heavy Industries, the company behind the Type 90, has become a global leader in the defense sector, inspiring other manufacturers to follow suit. The tank's design principles focusing on speed, firepower, and survivability have been emulated by tank manufacturers globally, shaping the way future tanks are built. The Type 90's legacy extends beyond its physical capabilities. It symbolizes Japan's commitment to peace and security, serving as a deterrent to potential aggressors. It stands as a testament to the ingenuity and perseverance of the people who developed it, embodying the spirit of innovation that has propelled Japan to the forefront of technology. Even as newer models come into service, the Type 90 continues to be a significant part of the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force. Its lessons continue to guide the development of future tanks, ensuring that its legacy is ingrained in the annals of military history. The Type 90 tank is more than just a machine of war. It is a symbol of technological achievement, a beacon of innovation, and a testament to human ingenuity. It has left an indelible mark not only on the battlefield, but also in the hearts and minds of those who appreciate the art of warfare. The Type 90 tank, a technological marvel that continues to inspire and influence the future of tank warfare.